Hello, Phil here from Wings of Pegasus and welcome to another video. So this video is really just to tell you guys about something that I have set up. And if you've been watching the live streams, you'll know this from not the last live stream, but the one before that I've set up a petition over on change.org. And this was just in response to somebody who commented on one of my videos where I was pointing out pitch correction that an artist or artists used and this person wanted to know what they could do. And when I say that, it was referring to how can somebody know what they're buying? Whether somebody who's singing is actually hitting the notes that you're hearing or whether their voice has been moved to that place or that pitch. So he then went on to say, do I contact a government official or something like that because I'd like to know what I'm buying. So from that I decided to set up a petition so that he but also other people if they want to they can sign this petition to just put it out there that some people want to know what they're listening to and I do write this on the petition itself about how everything's regulated in every other industry about buying a particular product and knowing what you're buying but it doesn't seem to be the same for the music industry so people can be buying a product that they think is somebody's natural voice but it actually isn't it's a pitch corrected voice which is taking their voice and then changing it into something else and then you hear the results of that pitch correcting process so with this video you will be able to see on screen the uh, petition that I started up and a few people have signed it already so thank you guys for doing that. As for where this ends or what happens to it, I don't know. <laughs> I suppose that's all dependent on how many signatures it gets. I'm sure that if it got a lot of signatures then it would be probably uh, newsworthy or at least worthy of reporting on. But it's just been set up so that people have a place to go that if you want to try and do something or at least if you just feel like you want to let it known that you want to know what you're listening to then you can sign that petition so yeah now that is over there you can find a link to the petition in the description below like I said there's no real goal for this or time limit or anything like that it's just getting people together who might be of a similar mindset so I think it is something that can help the music industry to be a little bit more transparent and transparency is what everybody looks for when they're making a decision about spending their hard earned money on a product whatever that product is so if you want to share this around then you can do like i said the links in the description so you can copy and paste that into anything that you want but this is just a side project and if anything happens with it then obviously i think it'll be interesting to follow up with it or just spend a little bit of time on it. The other thing is that it's not just for people who don't like pitch corrected or auto-tuned singers, it's for everyone just to have peace of mind. I know that a lot of people don't mind a singer using pitch correction or auto-tune, they don't mind the sound of it, in which case they would buy the product anyway. It's not going to make any difference but Having the peace of mind of knowing what you're buying, if there's a little symbol on there that does say that the vocals have been manipulated from that perspective, then somebody who doesn't mind is going to buy it. But at least the person who views it differently when that process has been applied to somebody's voice, for them, they might well choose to not buy that and go for another product that they know is genuine from a vocal perspective or somebody that has sung those notes has hit those notes so anyway thank you guys for your support on the petition so far as i said the links in the description below so you can click on that do what you want with that link and i will catch you guys at the next video see you then rock